Good morning, beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Terry Dion, and I am back with another video. I hope you guys are doing absolutely amazing. Today is Monday. I think it's August the 22nd, if I'm not mistaken, or the 23rd. I don't know, but it's Monday morning, you guys. And my Monday mornings are so different than what they used to be. I want to do like a morning motivation Tori gave me this idea that i'm going to try to start in september i really want to let me know if it's something you would like i mean i would like to do like short inspirational videos in the morning like just a positive just to get people going it won't be just like these videos it'll you know, just give you some positivity in the morning i don't know y'all let me let me talk to god a little bit more about that because i just i don't want to do anything that he doesn't want me to do motivate you guys but I'm you know I don't know but we'll see if it happens but I, I think it's gonna be okay to do that but I, I have to try to fit everything in that I'm already doing y'all and I'm having a hard time so I have to make my schedule and that is my phone y'all not not recording with my phone but my phone look at that girl Ooh, she bad but um yeah so we just got to figure out how to maneuver everything and that's what I've really been asking God like how do I do it all Lord be done well we're never gonna start with breakfast. I'm having eggs, um, old eggs, some watermelon, and you're gonna see the um, turkey sausage. All right, guys, here is my watermelon with a little bit of cinnamon on it, some boiled eggs with light salt and pepper, and my turkey sausage. And this is my delicious breakfast that I'm having with a glass of water just want to show you what I'm eating y'all saw what salam is eating pancakes are cool but for me I can't eat like that every day all right beautiful people let's just let the cat out of the bag all right do you guys see my clothes this is how I dry my clothes okay I do not put my clothes in the dryer really um, not that many clothes now I do put um, you know whites towels washcloths things but like things that are colorful or things that have certain material or even like that I think is cute I do not put in the dryer so I'm showing you now so when you start noticing this you're not gonna be like what in the world is she doing I'm just drying my clothes okay so I'm washing clothes I'm drying them and this is how I hang most of my clothes I'm just as real as y'all. This is what we got going on, and those are my clothes. And don't nobody come for your girl. Okay? Thank you. All right, so Salam just went to the store, and I am running out of hangers. So I just came to borrow some of her black hangers because I really like black hangers. Hopefully, she won't miss them. You better not say a word. All right, guys, I'm not as embarrassed as I was. If you look in that corner, those are all clean clothes. Um, that are on that counter those are clean and um, under it is some blankets um, pillow they're always there it's nothing dirty over there my bed I still haven't made I still haven't made it yet oh don't get my phone my bed I still haven't made it yet it's you know like this over here uh, we have I just took that flat floral thing off I actually washed it today but I put it on real quick to go um Oh my goodness, why is that bra hanging there? Don't look. Okay. I put the floral show on to take the trash out. And then that little pile right there is some stuff that I'm not sure what I'm about to do with it. But right here we have some fake roaches that I want to prank somebody with. But I don't know who I can prank with these because Kiera already pranked Salam with the fake roaches. Maybe I can put a fake roach in a food one day and we'll see how that works. I'm going to try that. Um, oops, I dropped it. Um, and that's it. That's 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 it. Everything is coming along, but it's not clean, but it's 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 much better than it was. Oh, those are some scarves hanging on my dresser. Those are not clothes, those are scarves that I wrap my hair with. And this is what I'm looking like. A little leftover lunch for today. It smells amazing. Thank you, Chef D. Hello, my beautiful people. I hope you guys are doing amazing today. First, let me start off by saying, y'all, look. So, yes, the nail is still broken, but this is the thing. This is the thing with the nail. So, my nail is broken, but you see that little piece that's still connected? Um, I don't know if it's going to focus on it or not, but that hurts. And I'm not ripping that off. 
I'm gonna, I've been soaking it. I've been putting Neosporin on my finger, um, my fingernail, and I'm just like, we're just gonna leave it alone. And I know I need to get my nails done, but I'm gonna let that heal for a couple of days before I let anybody touch it or mess with it because it might be really thin under there and I don't want my nails stinging, burning, or any of that foolishness. So we just gonna act like I don't got no broke nail, okay? Okay. I guess I'm about to go to the grocery store, get a couple things to cook for dinner, and probably show you what I'm going to cook tonight. I'm not sure what it is. I know Ethan asked me to make him some nachos. Now, this is the thing. I am not eating nachos. Oh, my gosh, guys. Guess what? Your girl lost four pounds. Yes, your girl lost four pounds. I told you guys that even though I did the little Big Mac thing over there, your girl has been, the majority of my meals have been eating clean and trying to eat between 11 and 7 or 11 or 12 and 8. So, I've really been starting my fasting back so i'm so grateful to god for those four, four pounds that are gone we are moving into the right direction okay we're not moving up we're moving back down okay yeah so ethan wants me to make him some nachos i will not be eating it but i do have a small pack of ground beef and i'm gonna make him a small 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 portion him a salam i do not know what i'm gonna cook for myself tonight i'm not hungry because y'all saw i just finished eating my leftovers but i'm gonna go to the store and try to get something for me and my mom for tonight and just a couple of groceries anyway so i will get back with you guys shortly i love you i love you i love you i love you all right we just finished the video and if you want to see it go to keeping up keeping up wow kicking it with the camp and girl i just gave our channel a whole new name we are not keeping up with nobody we are kicking it okay um <laughs> no um please you no they need to go child you need to put that camera down and um take notes when I'm driving because you don't drive. And you nobody know right. taking notes. For, I sure don't drive anything like you because I know how to drive. What? You got that right. All right, guys. Your girl is feeling good today. I'm feeling really, really good. Just feeling really, really good. You know what I'm saying? Feeling really, really good. Can she not drive with her hand on the phone? Do you do not know how to drive. I know that I'm going to need. Uh oh, me soon be driving with my knee. And you need to be driving with four eyes and two hands. She on the phone. She might be beat up. She ain't answer this phone. And now I'm done with Okay. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good from my head to my shoes. Know where I'm going now. Oh, I forgot the words. It's 80s music. All right, guys, so Ethan asked me to make him some beef nachos, so I'm gonna make him some nachos. Using this ground beef, of course, this salsa, I'm going to use this Velveeta cheese, and I'm gonna put this cream cheese in it and see if that gives it a kick. And here's the taco seasoning and his Doritos, and we got sour cream in the refrigerator. And he needs some type of vegetable, so I forgot the lettuce, so we're gonna give him this corn. Sorry, Ethan, forgot the lettuce. All right, you guys, this is the corn that I am making for Ethan, and if Salam eats some, too, she will have some. We gotta add some pepper, y'all. We gotta add a little bit of pepper. We got some pepper right here. Oh, probably not in there. I'm gonna throw that away. Where is the rest of the pepper? Y'all look at my cabinets. I know. Some of y'all are probably losing y'all mind. Like, oh my goodness, no organization. Not really. So don't even, don't, don't even do it. Don't even do it. Don't even do it. Pretty, say hey to the beautiful people. Hello, beautiful people. And my mama on the phone. Okay. Here go the ground beef. She hear me telling y'all, don't even do it. Don't come from my, I was gonna show y'all my freezer because I bought a few groceries today. I'm sorry, y'all. Hold on, it's a little foggy. Let me back up, let me back up. I went to this store today and I got some groceries, like a few things. And I was like, ooh, the beautiful people do not want to see my freezer looking like this. Oh, I love this ground beef. It barely has any fat or grease. We like that. We like that. Y'all, when I tell you I want to taste this dip so bad, I want to taste this dip. Look how creamy, cheesy, and saucy that's a made-up word it looks y'all want to dip a chip <laughs> but I'm not time to make tuna all right guys so I did taste one chip and I'm not gonna taste anymore okay and there is their corn so salami can get an amazing 
dinner tonight and I wish I could join them. See, that's the chip that I tried. Ethan eats his with Doritos, so mom will probably use these too. She's gonna add sour cream. Whew. Those little luckies. And when you only have yourself as a subject of I'm green. Look at Salam. Mm-hmm, Ethan. They're so annoying. I didn't mean to say old lady. I didn't mean it like that. So don't nobody come for me. I'm trying to show them how good it looks. My kids are so annoying. Y'all, I'm boiling my eggs. I made a little mistake by turning on this eye with the ground beef. Hopefully I didn't burn it. It looks like a, you know, a little bit of it. So whatever. It's not burnt, but... I'm upset with myself for that. Um, eggs right there. Tuna right here. Looks like it's sitting in water. I'm gonna add these eggs. I put a little bit of mayo in it. I need to add some relish. I'm just, ooh, y'all. It's just one of them guys. It's been going good, but it's just so busy. You know, you just kinda like, ooh. And we're gonna let this sit, cause we gotta let this get a little stiff, but them eggs gonna help with that. Go eggs. All right, y'all, it was just too much, so I'm just gonna show you guys everything I put in my tuna salad. Um, I put onions, bam, a little tiny squirt of mustard, mayo, sweet cubes, light salt, pepper, and I am boiling the eggs. And pretty grandma over there watching Salam's Miami trip. I wonder if they'll copyright me for my own baby's video. Y'all better not, but it's over there playing. Y'all say Salam, okay. And the eggs are still boiling. These are clean dishes. I sat the rack right here because I needed this side to dump out something. But I'm gonna wash it and put that back and put my dishes up. Cause y'all see ain't really no dishes in the sink cause your girl stays keeping stuff clean up in here. And I'll show you once I put the eggs in here. Oh, you know refrigerator is cool. Y'all don't know nobody with these type of magnets. 20 year old magnets right here, bam. These, this one new, this one new, this one new, this one new. This one is a couple years old, y'all done heard it. My little student got me these from Mexico, Mexico. And Amber got me that one from Cancun. And I got this from Jamaica, man. Yes, 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 yes. And we got this one from, ooh, what's that restaurant called? Cracker Barrel. And those came from Tasha. Um, yeah, Tasha got me those. And these two babies came from Six Flags. So y'all don't know nobody that refrigerated is this cool. You just tell me who's. I want to know. Leave their name down in the comments if their refrigerator is cooler than mine with the magnets. Please leave their name in the comments. And also, who got a lady with an afro on top of the refrigerator? I will wait. Okay, okay, I'm not there. But I still want to know. <laughs> All right, you guys. So this is some light salt I'm going to put in these cucumbers. I'm making kind of like a cucumber salad, but not really. Because I'm not putting tomatoes or anything in it. Just some salt, pepper, and a little bit of Italian dressing. All right, and then I'm gonna put this joint in the refrigerator and we're gonna let this thing do what it do, you know what I'm saying? Let them seasons, let them seasonings, you know, mix up a bit. And we're about to put the eggs in a tuna salad and I'm probably gonna put this in the refrigerator for tomorrow. My boiled eggs are jacked. <laughs> I don't make the best ones anymore. I'm putting them in some cold water. Hopefully they won't be too hard to peel and I'll be putting them in my tuna salad. And look at my video I just posted. Go watch it guys when I copied the era and me looking right like a mama, which I am. All right, we added the eggs you guys and this is my tuna salad. You probably won't see me eating it on this video, but definitely the next video. I'm gonna put the top on it and we putting this in the refrigerator. So I love y'all so much, I really do. All right, guys, I just want to thank you guys and let you guys know how much I appreciate you. Um, I don't know if I say it enough, but all of my amazing subscribers who are always commenting and talking to me, Ayana, thank you. Um, Tiffany, thank you. It is so many of you that I cannot even think of right now because I don't have my phone by me. 
um, but so many of you who are always leaving me nice comments, Emily, um, there are more of you, um, oh, I wish I could just remember names, but all of you, I love you, I appreciate you so much, always commenting and watching and supporting, you guys are supporting my dream by watching and by um, subscribing, and I love you and I appreciate you guys, we are on the road to 13,000 subscribers, you guys have to understand, if you want to do a YouTube channel, please do it, you guys, please don't let anybody tell you not to even if you don't want to do it for like your job but if you want to do it for a hobby go for it you guys um, I have grown so much just from being dedicated for a little over a year. I know that I started my channel four years ago, but I was not consistent with my channel. I focused on um, Salam's channel and helping her grow, but I've been focusing on my channel for, I guess, almost like two years, and I have grown to 13,000 subscribers, and my views are going up. So I appreciate you guys, and I know, I just know that we're going to reach our 100,000 subscribers and 100,000 people watching each and every video. I will never give up, and I will never stop believing that, and I just want to thank you guys so much for sharing my videos for watching my videos for leaving comments it really helps my channel grow thank you i love you and we are out see you next time guys